What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we are putting Janice in the hot seat. Last time we did this video, I was in the hot seat. I'm ready to get my get back. Honestly, I'm not even scared. The questions aren't too crazy, but they are, I will say, personal. The, the purpose of this video is to see how uncomfortable you get. Really? That's, that's the purpose of a hot seat? like answering personal questions. Well, today you have no choice. I have a choice. So, yeah, you always have a choice. But today you have no choice. This one isn't too crazy, but start it off late. Someone wants to know genuinely, why do you like such a dark aesthetic? I don't know. I think, like, growing up, my grandma was always into it. So it's like, my grandma was my favorite person in the world. She made me interested in it. So we always look forward to Halloween and stuff like that. And then I always gravitated towards more so different, like, things growing up and everyone made fun of me for liking emo stuff and I just thought it was cool because those are people who aren't afraid to be who they are I think everyone likes to conform and just like like be like each other and I don't like being like anybody else because I just feel like that's corny have you found God yes okay just making sure Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior. I don't like evil things. It just like like spooky things and dark aesthetic. I feel like fits me best. It's just what I like. Next question is, is Isaiah the best you ever had? Do not lie. You can be 100% honest. Best what I ever had? Just in general. Am I the best guy you ever had? Best boyfriend, best fiance, best person in my life. Are you still questioning or you're just answering it? I'm right? just like, what best I ever had what? like? Just the best, I, like the Drake song, best I ever had. Am I the best you ever had? Yes. Okay, thank you. That's all I wanted to know. Isaiah is genuinely the best person yeah, no. I have in my life, honestly. He's supportive. Uh -huh, sweet. He's kind and caring uh -huh, sweet. when it comes to me only. Yeah, I don't have a soft spot for many people. <laughs> yeah, cause he Her though, can... I, I'll like I'll cry and all that for it, but nobody else really. Yeah, he can actually be very mean sometimes. I'm I'm like I'm I don't wanna say I'm 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 not a horrible person. No, I'm not just... I'm not a horrible person. I just like not emotional. Yeah, I don't have sympathy for many people. Yeah. So, especially if it's like some BS, like you're crying over something stupid, like, but with her, I like, I try to, like, just for her, for her sake, I, I'm more soft. Yeah, and but I feel like that's the way it should be. He's also like a man. Like, there's a lot of, like, boys out there that, like, I had interest in and they just weren't, I could, like, bitch them around, like. I feel like that's what they think our relationship is, what? but, like, I don't know, like, a lot of people, they'd be like, oh, I think Janice wears the pants in the relationship, and I'm like, no. I wouldn't say I wear the pants in the relationship either, I feel like it's just a 50-50 thing, yeah. you know what I mean? But behind cameras, guys, like, I don't, I don't know how to explain it. I feel like this is becoming about me at this point, that's not, <laughs> that's not the case. <laughs> but yeah, so yes, I'm the best you ever had. Yeah. Okay, that's amazing. Next one is, and this one you gotta be honest, because I'm actually genuinely uh, curious. Um, what are some icks of me that bother you? Oh my god, when Isaiah like gets a certain She got right into state, it, she knew. No, because it's just this one thing literally pisses me off so much. Like, I literally yell at him for it. You know exactly what it is. <laughs> what is it? Like, Isaiah finds these sayings randomly, or like he finds like song lyrics and he'll just repeat it over and over oh, again oh but there's a new one every week and so he won't shut the freak up about it like like it's non-stop what was it the other day oh my god i wanted to punch you in the face there's a new one like every week there's actually yes. it, it, i go through cycles like every like three or four days i have a new saying that i'll repeat but it's like non-stop i might have a condition i don't even know non-stop literally non-stop like i'll be like okay babe he'll be like like, for example, he'd be like, no, I'm Dirty Dan. And then, like, all day he'd be like, no, I'm Dirty Dan. No, Randomly, I'm Dirty like, Dan. At random points, I'm telling you, like, I'm like, I get weird. Yes. <laughs> and I'll be like, babe, it's enough. He'll be I'll like, be talking to myself. No, I'm Dirty Dan. Like, shut up already. So, yeah, that, that. That's is, it? Yes, that's it. Okay, interesting. That's pretty impressive for me. This one, this is where it starts to get personal. I'm starting to heat up a little bit. Ready? Okay. What's your body count? Yo, everybody always wants to know this question. Everybody wants to know the body count. Just tell them already. It's like seven. Just say it already. Shut up. Say it. I feel like even if I say it, nobody will believe me anyways. Then at that point, then just stop asking if you don't believe it. Like, it's funny because when I never answer this question, everybody's like, it's like 40, yo, oh, she must have been a whore. Oh, she's a whore. Sorry. One. It's one. Are you, that's your answer, one? Yes. It's one, guys. That's literally it. We're not even trying to be sarcastic. It's just one. Just one. So there, there it is. You guys can stop asking that question. And I don't say it because, like, I told, like, for for example, I'm going to say a short story. For uh, my bachelorette party, everyone was saying their body count. And I was like, one. And everybody was like, you're a fucking loser. And I'm just like, what the fuck? Like, it's just, I don't want to be made fun of for it. Bro, but when then, did it become uncool to, like, just be your, like, to not get ran through? You know what I mean? And I'm not saying you, I'm not saying you're ran through if you have two, three bodies, whatever. You know? But still, just, like 
I don't always get made fun of for that. Like, when is it a flex for a girl to be out like that? You know what I mean? That's why I, I, it made me question myself because I'm like, damn, like, so I was, I grew up very like conservative, like Christian, my family's Christian. So I grew up saying I, the person that I will lose my B card with is going to be the person that I marry. And I always said that. And it obviously that's, I suck to that because I'm marrying him. So next question again, we're, we were heating up with the last question. Now we're going to finally answer that question. It's actually crazy. We're getting hotter. All right, we're turning up the heat. Here we go. Someone says, I know she hates answering these questions. And that's why I ask, what is your favorite position? so annoying. I don't have one. I feel like you do. It's like one of two. I, I feel like you do though. Maybe me, like when I'm on top. So she, it, she wants me to be a pillow princess. That, yeah. That's what it is. Okay. Thanks for making me seem like a man, babe. You, you, told, you said I was a man earlier and now you're just taking it from me. I know. I'm just saying like, <laughs> I don't know. Next one is, do you like to dress up when it comes for sexy time? No. Is that something that you would be interested in? No. Like role play, stuff like that? No. Just straight to the business? Yes. Okay. I don't got time for extra shit. I like that. I like when we just get right to it. Like, just screw everything else. Let's just get right to it. I feel like it. that's doing too much, in my opinion. I feel like it's fun every now and then, but most of the time, just get it. let's just get to it. We know why we're here. Yeah, like, we're grown. We don't need to be doing all that extra shit. <laughs> what is the naughtiest thing you have ever done? Like, I'm doing this, and I know I'm not supposed to be doing this, but I'm doing it anyway, because I'm a naughty little girl. <laughs> That is so weird. <laughs> I had to, guys. That's what I'm talking about. Like, I'd be out of pocket sometimes. I don't really do anything, like... It doesn't have to be, like, current day. Like, anything you, you've done in the past or whatever. Have you ever, like, left class to go, like, make out with a boy in the hallway? Like, stuff no. like that. Oh, I would always skip school. Like, oh my god, wait. What if I get in trouble for saying that? Oh, I'm snitching. Take away my credits. I'm s your credits? <laughs> you didn't even go to college. What? No, I'm saying high school. You already got your diploma. It's too late for that. Uh, like that, I guess that's something that I would do. Like all my friends had co-op, which is like work. No, you would just skip school. That's and I would saying. leave every day at like 12 o'clock. And I would come home and tan. Like, and mind you, I, I was one of the kids that actually left school to go to You're work. You're such a hater that you... Yes, bro. How is it that you get to leave at school every day 12 noon and I get to do the same, but I got to go work? Until like four You're or five o'clock. You're the one who chose to work, not me. I, I was following the rules. I'm sorry. I mean, I worked, but I worked late. So I would come home, tan, relax, and everybody would still be in school. I'm not going to lie. We, we getting a little crazy now. So this is literally heating up as the time goes on. Okay, so have you ever done self-service? We'll call it that. Have you ever pleasured yourself? Yes. Nice. <laughs> that's so weird. You're answering these questions. That's so crazy to me. All right, now, I don't want to dwell on it too long. I know you're probably getting uncomfortable right now. Yeah, I hate these yes, type of questions. Yes, I've been waiting for this. Next one is, does she love to blank it? And I'm going to use, you have to use your mouth for this. Do you like to blank it? No. Is it because of me? No. <laughs> it's just not something that's enjoyable. I don't think any woman... Enjoys doing that? I don't think so. And if they do, then they like are nymphos or something. Next one is, what is your favorite thing to do in bed? Sleep. Besides that? No. Like, what really, me. like, gets you going? There's got to be something that, what was the question? Yeah, there's got to be something that you love to do all the time in bed. When you kiss me. Okay. I like to kiss. I like to kiss you. Okay, so we'll go with that then. All right, I think this is going to be... I don't think that I had given you personal questions like this. Hey, if they didn't ask, if like, if they didn't ask you, I mean... That's not my problem. They did. I if just you guys want to put me. Pick those. You can pick them if you want. If you guys want to see me in the hot seat again, answering these type of questions, I don't care. I'll do it. All right, we got two more questions. Mm -hmm. This is the last like freaky one. At first, did you think it was too small for your liking? No, because I really didn't have anything to compare it to. Yeah, we pushing two inches over here, baby, on a good day. Mind that business. Like if somebody's thing is really, really small, that's scary. The but one like, inch your pincher. Yeah. The one inch your pincher. But no, I didn't. Yeah, like, this is what I come with, so if you don't like it, then you don't you don't have me. <laughs> Last one. It's not a freaky question, but I genuinely would like to know. If I died, how long would it take you to move on? And be completely honest. I don't want you to say I don't I wouldn't never move on because I wouldn't want you to like die alone and stuff like that. I would not want that for you. Like if I died like right now at this moment, how long would it take you to move on? Long time. What's a long time? A I year or two years? years? No way, bro. There is no way you would not. I go. genuinely don't think I could be in any like real relationship where I'm in love with someone ever again. No? 
I'll try to come back as a ghost and still do what I gotta do for you, but <laughs> no. at the end of the day, I want I, you to find peace. That will be my peace. Coming oh back to mess gosh. with you. That is his what? You're gonna haunt me? That's your peace? It'll be a little funny. I'll give you little notes, like little signs and stuff. I'll like write on the mirror, like, you know, it's just me. Don't get too scared. Oh, if I see someone draw a wanker on the window, I know it's you for sure. <laughs> oh, all right. <laughs> all right, guys. So that is it for today's video. We hope you guys enjoyed it. Anything else you want to say, babe? No, yeah, done. Read my whole diary. That's everything everybody had ever asked. Now that you can stop asking, that at least that's the bright side. People are still going to ask me. Probably, yeah. And we'll just give them the link to this video. And then people still not going to believe me, too. I already know. Yeah, no way her body count is one. She has to have at least 12. Literally. And she does. But we won't tell you guys that. Uh, <laughs> All right, y'all. So that is it for today's video. Again, we hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button. Comment down below if you guys want to see me in the hot seat again with any of those personal questions. And we'll make it happen. But with all that being said, we'll see you guys in the next video.